So when is the best time to post on social media? Hi, welcome to this week's Toolbox TV. Um, and that is a question that we quite often hear from time to time from various different electricians, various different trades people is when's the best time to get interaction on your posts on social media? Um, I guess you can almost preempt the answer that I'm going to give because as with many things that we talk about as toolboxers and as marketers of our business, everything goes back to your ideal customer. So an ideal time for me to post would be completely different from an ideal time for you to post or for anybody else to post because it's going to heavily depend on when your ideal customer is using the internet. And only you and your ideal customer will really know that. If you've done the research on your ideal customer and you've really worked out who they are and what they do and where they uh, go to gather their information or where they go for social uh, interaction online and so on and so forth, then you'll know where they are, you know, whether they're using LinkedIn, whether they're using Facebook, whether they're sitting scrolling through TikTok or perhaps even Instagram. So you'll know where to be putting your post or where to be focusing your posts at least. Um, and then, again, understanding who they are, you should know when they're actually doing that. You know, is it a uh, somebody who's working on a night shift who only sits in during the day and looks at posts? Is it somebody who gets in in the evening that does it? Is it somebody who, while they're at work, is able to scroll through and look at their social media? Only you're going to know once you know who your ideal who your ideal customer is. So the advice from me, as far as uh, when you post on social media, is don't overstress it. Don't worry too much about the when of it. Just make sure that you are actually doing it. Uh, again, you know we get this question from people uh, sometimes who aren't even doing posts, and they're more concerned about getting everything perfect than just getting everything done. And sometimes done beats perfect. Sometimes the fact that you get maybe two or three posts out during the course of a week, and I would suggest a minimum of three posts a week going out. But if you can do one a day, do one a day. But the bottom line is, get the post done, and they will be on people's timeline when they log in to their social media. You know, if you're doing your targeting right, if you've got your interaction right on the uh, social media platform in terms of your what you're posting, something of interest, something of educational value, something of entertainment value, uh, and the old promotional post now and again, if you're getting that mix right, then the posts will be there when somebody opens up their Facebook profile, when somebody goes into their, their LinkedIn profile, your posts will be there because the algorithm will have decided that this is worth that person seeing, so they'll put it in front of them. So it's not necessarily going to be about the timing. It's not necessarily going to be what time of the day do you actually post. It's going to be more important that you actually understand who your ideal customer is, that you are posting content that your ideal customer is going to be interested in, and then if you are concerned about the time when you're posting, once you know when your ideal customer is logging in to do this type of thing, then you can narrow it down even closer that way. So I hope that helps people. And this is like social media across the board. This is whether you're posting on LinkedIn, whether you're posting on Twitter, whether you're posting on TikTok. It's right across the board. Understand who your ideal customer is. Use the right kind of content to get their interest and to prove to the algorithm that it's worth the algorithm's time to put you in front of the right kind of people. And once you've done that, you should be golden. Until the next time, continue to learn and grow, and I'll see you in the next video.